Okay, this is part six, and I just want to say last time there were ten LEDs in circuit S1, secondary circuit S1, and there were two circuits of three LEDs each in secondary circuit S2. And now I'm going to show you what I've added since a month ago. So uh, now I have 16 LEDs in the place of 10. I added six more LEDs and um, instead of three LEDs on S2 I have four in each segment of S2 and part of that is because um, there's a capacitor that I added to the 220 micro Henry inductor on each of them. The interesting thing is that they're different value uh, quite a bit different value to keep the lights the same. I changed the LEDs. It's not about the LEDs. It, I think it has to do with the distance from the initial um, uh, pulses. I don't know. Uh, but they're, But it doesn't seem to make any difference if I change the LEDs around. It has to do with this place and this place. Um, the other thing I added was a... Um, this is a 105. This is a 1 microfarad capacitor and um, a toroid from another jewel thief. This is, uh, I'm just putting the secondary of this toroid in there. And, um, and that together, that's in series first. And then there are four LEDs, each one having its own little tank circuit in series with the LEDs. Okay, the tank circuits are by themselves, but in series. So there are three of them. This one operates for both uh, light sets, and this one operates this light set, and this one operates this light set. Okay, so that's it for S2. Now back to S1. Uh, this other side of this um, filter was staring at me, morning lights, so I tried a number of things, and I've ended up with simply having three LEDs in series across this. And now I've added an extension to S1. I've just made the lines longer, the S1 lines longer, and off of the L1 part of it, I have 150 microfarads and um, another inductor. Um, this is 243 micro Henry's um, hand wound inductor and three lights. Now every once in a while these lights go dimmer than the rest of them and all I have to do is touch them, touch them once, touch this wire once and they brighten up. I don't know what that means uh, but I've got 30 lights. 30 lights! This is a drawing that is sort of a drawing of what I just showed you. Here's the S2 with um, that separate tank circuit with the hand wound toroid and then the four LEDs with the little tank and four LEDs with another little tank and room for more. And then S1 um, with its now 16 LEDs in series and then off of the filter inductor three more LEDs in series and then I said I extended the lines this is what I meant out here over to the right this is what's not accurate on this drawing um, I was playing around with this and I posted this drawing um, on over unity um, but some of these figures have changed but there is an inductor a hand wound inductor here leading to um, it says one microfarad, but it's really 150 microfarad. And the inductor is about 243 hand wound. And it hold, and it, and w even with, with any of it, the four LEDs were way too light. So I took out the fourth one because three LEDs are about equal to all the rest of it. So it's pretty close to what you saw um, with those differences over here.